Now I'm about to make some kind of a mazel meal and doubling the recipe again. I go to the non-fat dry cool pan and it says uh, I have to put a dash of a quarter of salt. So that's the early ingredients into a microwave. I might want to hot. I stir one or two minutes. Whatever. Every 30 seconds I'm washing it. Boil over. Oh, I forgot to put the salt in now. It happened the other time before. I sorted my thing up again. I have the salt up here. Uh, right down here like that. I guess I'll put it on pause again. Like that. Well, I put the quarter piece of salt that I got there. It says to stir all ingredients in a two cup. Well, this is a four cup. So I stir and I stir all the ingredients together. To make your milk like before. Like, um, it was the night before when 24 or 42 hours knocking at my door. I'm stirring it, and then I think I'll add some of these too. I only have some left. The right ain't pantry. So now I'll put it on pause again. I, I had my morning coffee and my uh, cinnamon pot and all my medication. So I put it on pause again. I finally put all the dried pineapple in there. So I'm continuing to stir. I had double the recipe. It is three tablespoons, but basically it's a hundred and twenty whatever. So I'm stirring it as it says right here for one minute. Let's see, one minute, maybe one condition of dun 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 Have another timer over there. One minute I could put up there. I think it's almost one minute or so. So I see. Stir for about one minute. Well, that's pretty good. So I said, over here like that. And that's all you got. So I put it there like that. And uh, this is a nice case. I have the other thing in. So I'll hit it down like that. One to two minutes. Well, we'll go to something like in between. We'll go one and a half. Yeah, that's what it says. Yeah, I doubled the recipe though. The microwave they cook pretty fast though. Well, that's in uh, because uh, cooking down the problem. See, some people have a 700, some people have a I'll look at how it's doing. And maybe I'll put some of the, this in there too. Or maybe the other root loop thing that's I think I might have. One and a half minutes. Uh, we, uh, and then, so I guess I'll put it on. Uh, I think I'll have some syrup there to soak it up. That makes it lightly sweet in that way. So it's one and a half minutes. So this is going on for five. 
her then. Well, this is the harps. <laughs> oh. And there we go, ding. Oh. Oh, I guess well, this is what I have ah. together. I like the kind of artificial fruit loop. And you know, with some of those pineapple. I doubled the recipe in a way. And that's pretty good, would you say? Mmm, yummy. So I kind of doubled the recipe a bit. Not that much, I guess. I don't know. Whatever. I doubled the recipe. Whatever, so. Well, I guess I'll just. Wait, uh. Let's see how this goes. Pretty good, so. I'm also in the end, I have some of the pineapple and whatever. And I didn't double as much as I should have. Well, they blend together the milk and the water. The Kruger type, whatever. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 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 Mm See the pineapple chunk there. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. my vitamins. Mm hmm. There we go. Mm. I need the microwave a little bit more.
for scrambled egg breakfast. I put it for 70, 70 power, 70 percent. I put it on for two minutes. And then I'll put some, maybe some cheese in here. Uh, this is the Kraft single cheeses. Uh, I kind of modified the recipe I usually do all the time. As you can plain you see, it is 8.30 in the morning. I have my cinnamon pot tart. I sort up my vitamins already. So, um, let me just see how this works here. Uh, this is, I already uploaded another video about this. I sprayed some of the, uh, non-stick sodium free. Uh, it went ding. Let's see. How was well it cooked? Uh, it seems a little runny, so maybe I'll do it for, I think, another minute on maybe high. Let's see. The other one, it was like three minutes. So maybe, uh, well, maybe after 30 seconds. I can see. Uh, we'll do it there. That would be like two and a half minutes. I think I'll stop it here, right at 30 seconds. Don't want to overcook them, so I go, ah, and it will come back. That might be well done. Yeah, well, they look a little still runny. Yeah, they look a little runny. So, now I guess I'll, one more 30 seconds. Ah, uh, this is going, I think, in the other direction. See, you go this way, that way. See, this is breakfast time again. This is almost the same type of thing picks up here. Now, this is how you make some eggs without breaking any egg. I still have some uh, Ralph over there, but no, it's for this and that. Well, I think that should be about the right amount. So, ding. And we'll see how well it cooked. Well, uh, it looked pretty good, I guess. Uh, now I guess I'll put it on pause again. Remove the cheese slices. And so I'm gonna kind of put them in, put some, I guess, some salt and pepper until I put it on pause again. Put it on for a few more minutes. It's a little bit runny. So I think it's finally done. As you can see, this is breakfast time. It's 8.35. I'm now having a kind of a breakfast. Oh, yes, I'll put it on. I put some wheat germ in and the artificial cereal from the Ralph store. And I put some milk in, so I'm going to put a little cinnamon in. And I have some strawberries. And I got a call around. Nine, something about some type of medication. So this is one for more information. I'm going to remove this. It's a right A pantry. And that is some type of a brand. And at the bottom, there's some wheat germ. Uh, the artificial rice cereal is lightly sweetened. I like a little cinnamon here, too. That's very good. And then, who? I'll put some up. There. So I threw it on like that. Now you can see, it is about breakfast time. Now I put it in here like that. I have all my things sorted out already. I did a little zap in there. Now, I think I'll put it on pause and I'm going to put some strawberries on. So, as we're continuing, as you can plainly see, these are strawberries. Well, I've been in food since 1976. These are strawberries and they're polar. Well, I kind of, <clears throat> it's hard to do that again, so I guess I'll put it on pause again. No, it doesn't want to open up. 
I have this, I don't know if it fit. No, nothing hardly fits. That might fit. I really fit. I have something in here though. That might work though. Uh, let's see. Oh, that's too. I don't know. Let's go over. And that will do. I guess that will work. Yeah, I have all these too, so I'll put it on pause again. Finally worked. Had to twist a bit. Is it too? Oh, here we go. I'll put it on pause again. Now, as you can see, it's open. Polar in the light syrup. Oh, I don't know. Don't make a mess. Well, then I'll put it on pause again. I just kind of jumped something out. It's all my too, for heaven's sake. This and that. Turn it around here like that. I gotta remember which side. Made in China. Everything be made in China. Put in a little whatever. Well, that's a piece of rubber. I was trying to turn it off with. Yeah, great to eat some rubber. <laughs> kind of funny. Anyway, so. I guess I'll put it on pause again. As you can see, here the time is a quarter after, a quarter to eleven. So here oh, is well, yeah. my kind of a breakfast. I put some wheat germ in and some of the life cereal with a little bit of cinnamon and the strawberry that I showed you before. I made a little recording in a little radio shack, but it cut it off. It goes like this, though. I think, therefore I am. This is the only thing that Descartes could be sure of. Descartes was a person who uh, has studied the mathematics from all these mathematicians, and they had all these postulates and assumptions. But he said we have to start from scratch because some of those assumptions weren't very correct. So he started out and he was thinking and that's what he hit upon. The only thing he could be sure of is I think, therefore I am. I do exist. But my existence could be whatever. I might be dreaming on this, I might be dreaming on that. It's really hard to tell, though. So, that's the only thing he could be sure of. And now, with the quantum effects and all the stuff that Einstein really hated, uh, there's so many possibilities. It starts out with the probability and the possibility of the location of an electron. As they said in the beginning, it was like an orbital, like going around the planets around the sun. However, they're really in a probability cloud. The two most inner shell, the one inner shell, can really only hold one. However, due to the Pauli's exclusion rule, the spin of the electron, if it's in the reverse direction, it can exist in the same shell. Then the next shell has a capacity for only eight. And because of that is how we have covalent bonds. Silicon and carbon. And we are basically carbon-based. Silicon is how they make wafers and chips. Like what's inside of this AT&T cell phone. Very micro in size. So anyway, this is a pretty good breakfast. Now it's almost 11 o'clock. So I mix and match or whatever, then I maybe have some, I guess, some Stouffer's product.
So anyway, I guess I'll put this on. Uh, to remove the film cover. However, if I do that, it usually boils over. So instead, I use one of the kind of knives that I got a long time ago at the 99 cent store. Let's see, as I guesstimate the direction. Oh, this house off again. Uh, I think it might be way down yonder in that direction. So I use this little knife, you see. Family age, stainless, China. Everything in China. I finally use this. Through the top of the strawberry. Oh, I wash it. Oh, it's still steady. Can't remember everything. So I go carve about here like that. Because I don't, it usually boils over. So, I go here like that. And I'm not carving here. And I kind of rip it up. I went a little bit close over there. <coughs> now I go this way. I think that may be all the right time. That get too close again. Like boil over again. I hate this so much. Well, that turns on with my voice. I went downstairs. Take my personal property up. So now, as I've carved, it says um, seven minutes. So I put it, I think, on, I think, about, I'll do three and a half and three and a half. I'll let stand as I'll put the timer on. For one, as it says there. I'll let stand in my to complete the cooking. So, that was kind of nice. I kind of use this. Looking at up. And I have the natural sunlight coming in. Now I just put this in the This is my favorite spoon. So, as yeah, the children know, I have some peas and whatever. I don't know. It has peas and some mushrooms. Sorry, and a creamy sauce. Egg noodle. No preserve. So, as I say, I do it for about, I guess, three and a half minutes. Miss Emerson. There we go. There we go. We go three and thirty. See how easy it is to do? And I get the reward inside. There's a pink thing there. So, I forgot to put my glass bowl away. Well, I rinse it very good. So it's pretty dry. Oh, says he, that's all right. I put it right here. No, oh, whatever. Doesn't I had the scrambled eggs for breakfast the other day. Ah, oh, you can eat it, it's beginning to spin. Oh, they're my favorite spoon. I have something cold, too. So here we go. I'm running off to the races. This is the Nutcracker Sweet from Tchaikovsky. Pretty sure that's in the public domain, so I don't have any complaints. From there, I kind of wash my hair a little bit. I fall a little bit in my other place. So it spins around and around and around. Dun, 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 dun. Two, eleven, two, ten, two, nineteen. Now we go start when it goes ding. Oh, we have to do it again for another three minutes and thirty seconds.
We're not through yet, though. Now we go. I think. Yeah. This is a dance of the sugar plum fairies. Something I, like I don't know. Don't have the thing in front of me. I burned it in my other thing over there. That's the bedroom. So this is one minute. I said it for three and thirty. So I have to wait. I can kick countdown. See, it's bubbling. And I had to remove the cover and boil all over. Yeah, I always modify the instructions myself. And it's easier that way. No, there we go again. Me. This is me. Right there. Now you can play me, see? It's 11. 46 a.m. And let's see, the barometer is. <coughs> let's see, it's decreasing in inches. So I turn it here to mark the spot uh, a little bit there. Now it goes ding. However, remember, we have to do it for another 3 minutes and 30 seconds. I kind of. Give it a spin. I right, uh. And then we do another three and a thirty. I don't know, I guess it's maybe going in the same direction. It really doesn't matter to me. Oh, so, here we go. Here we go again. Around the world in thirty days. I did go around the world. Uh, let's see. Ness in 30 days. Ness around the world. Well, of course, we flew by jet from here to there. Well, it was kind of weird. I didn't know. We didn't see. It was kind of dark when we left. We got a jet plane at LAX, Bobby and I, for Find X. He was the electrical engineer of the field service manager I had several hats, really. Uh, we were both stationed at Castle Air Force Base. And uh, I think it was 1978 when I was looking for an electronic technician job. I went to somebody's private house and ran to the house there day. I even know his email address. Dan. I used to work for DNA. That's <laughs> kind of the joke for about six months. DNA Associates. Yes. I went to San Diego too. We had this thing. It was a miner and this prospector. They went out to sea and they were kind of amazed how on the sea floor, as it generally slopes out, there's these magnesium nodules. Uh, they're kind of uh, loosely on the top. They couldn't figure out how they got there. Well, I Geology and nowadays has progressed immensely. As you can plainly see, we have another countdown. Now this might be the dance of the sugar plum fairies. Uh, sounds like it. Uh, counting down one more minute to go there, and we'll go one minute to start there for the timer. See? Press start. And then I'll say cooking time in. It's only 50 seconds or 51. Counting down again. As you can plainly see, it is really lunchtime again. And we have only a few minutes more to go. I kind of turn this on a little bit. So we kind of make the thing blow away. Tease some ventilation going. 
Yes, sir. Now go to team pretty soon. And we're counting down. Twelve, that was my game. Eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, eight, five, five, six, five, One, and then I'll go ding, ding, ding. <coughs> now we press start with the timer. As it's like you see, leave in the microwave to heat the cooking. Carefully remove tray. Microwave and enjoy. This is 20 pounds of protein. That's pretty good. Oh, if you preheat this and that and cook for 45 minutes, whatever. That uses a lot of energy, really. Now we see the countdown again. Uh, 30, 29, and 25. 22 and 20. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure I have it on repeating the entire thing. I'm pretty sure. I was just repeating the same. That's repeating on. Oh, there it goes. See, it's going ding, ding, ding. It says cook time in. So we cancel their line. Now, now I put it on pause, I guess. What you plainly see is a code there. I am the one who gets the reward. Now it says, I go over here like this. And then over here like that. It says, carefully remove the microwave, so I do. Mm. See if I had it would all boil over. So I just go over here like this. Over here. See if I had rip it off completely, it would boil all over the place. So I just gently put it in here. I have some other thing. I guess I'll put it on pause again. That looks pretty yummy too. I have carefully removed it from there. I see the little part there. Now I have some seasoning over here. Oh, uh, that should be why I had this. I put that this way over there. Now, I like the seasoning I get here. Oh, uh, this here, this is pretty good. This is a little garlic powder. I use it here like that. Use it around so that I don't like it all. Oh, the long time ago. No, I go like this. No, I'll twist it on like that. And then the other seasoning of salt. Here. This is a swivel sword. I got a long time ago from the Oh, he's in here too. And I go here. Like I have my vitamins all set up here. But this is pretty good here. This really isn't anything else. Well, then I'll just over here. Like that. I have some ketchup too. Let me pull it down very good too. Well, I put this here. This is a swivel in the store. How easy it goes here. I come over here. Nothing really hit very hard. And I guess I'll put it on pause. Here we go. Now I'm going to put some ketchup in. Some Heinz ketchup. I squeeze the other one out. Now I'm going to put this in here. That would be pretty good. So we can put it on pause. As you can see, I squeeze some of this in there. That's pretty good. Oh, there's no one here. Better than my hair when I turn it off. I don't want to go too much, really. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now I put the ketchup out right in here. Right in the back. 
No, I have some milk. Yeah, right there. Yeah, that's pretty yummy. No, I forgot. I need my drink. I think we're gonna get beer again. I put some uh residue, I guess. Shut the front door, man. It is shut. I'll go over here. No, I don't here. Put it over here. Now we come over here. Put this over here. That's the front door, right here. No, this isn't really good. Well, it's hard to eat. And they do eat at the same time. So, I guess I'm gonna relax a bit. a grueling day already. So, I guess I'll cheer it up a little bit. Yeah, as it says, it's got i always got something Christmas in the hop. See, if I had written the hop for me, it would boil all over. I know that all the time. See, I'm very well experienced with this thing, really. Well, that's pretty good. You mix it up like that. And we continue making and mixing and making. You kind of cut this up here now. See, the ketchup and whatever, and the other seasoning. Together. So it's pretty good. Dun, 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 dun. We'll put it on stop. 